Home teams are 5-0 and on this Monday night, but the road team has not trailed in this one. Memphis on top of Phoenix 59-48 behind a 23-point first half from Mike Conley. It's the American Express Halftime Report. Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, Kenny the Jet Smith, and Charles Barkley, thank you very much for joining us tonight. Uh, 59-48 is the count, and when you talk about the American Express teammates, you got a guy who was just named an all-star again in Marc Gasol for the Memphis Grizzlies, and the guy who is still waiting for that first all-star call in Mike Conley. 12 points on the night for Gasol, 4 out of 8, and Conley with his highest scoring half of the season. In fact, in a career, never had 23 points, but he has it. <laughs> Tonight, uh, wow. for a long time, it was always, when you talked about Memphis, it was always the bump and grind and uh, no three-pointers. They've really upped the three-point uh, output this year. Still, Gasol, Zebo, formidable. Yeah, you know, uh, Gasol, nine years in, Zebo, 16 years in. You know, like how to play the old-school basketball it is the bump and grind. But Gasol, you know, is definitely one of the top two centers in the league. Has this ability to, you know, shoot from the outside. Been shooting very, very well this year. You know, he's just a great play. And I love to get people open. Love mm. to do the little things right there. Bump, get them open. Up, oh, that's my shot. I'll take the shot. And, you know, all-star for him is well, well deserving. Right here, get it. Make the pass right here. Give it to Zebo. I asked Chuck how many years Zebo got left. I don't know, but Chuck, well, they didn't show, but he was sprinting up and down the court. I'm going to say about three or four more years, Chuck, with Zebo. No, they're playing well right now. He's 35 uh, I, years old. Well, I think the thing about Zebo, he is a perfect example. You know, we get so enamored with talent, guys who can really, really run and really, really jump. This guy had a terrific career just knowing how to play basketball, how to use his body. Mark Gasol, to me, is, is just a flat-out stud. Um, Mike Conley, I've said, he's been the most underrated player in the NBA the last 10 years. Uh, the problem they got is they're not as good as the teams on top. Uh, you know, they would not be favored against the Warriors or the Spurs. Uh, but I think they got a chance against every other team. Uh, but I don't think they could beat the Warriors or the Spurs in the West. That's their biggest problem. Interesting number on Marcus Gasol. First eight seasons took 66 threes. Those are attempts. He's made 72 this season wow. for Memphis. Before and, I go to the board, yeah. what year is Mike Conley? Uh, underdog, underdog knows that. Is he's got to be eight. eight. Mike Conley? Yeah. No, I say yeah. he, I think he's in double digits. I don't know. He's, good. he's not 30 yet. Okay, he's okay. Yeah. okay you said. Yeah. The, I just wanted to make sure that if he was supposed to underrated play the last 10 years, that he was actually in the league for 10 years. Yeah. Well, it, even if I was wrong by a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> what about his joke? Slap just I round it up around it. Do it. Do it. Uh, so anyway, I'm going to the board. Hey, Jake, Jet, did you see last week? Last I Monday? saw you beat him to the board. Yeah, thank you. I did see that. You know, make sure. We caught it around my house, Kenny. What's that? Slow against slower. Slow against slower, but slow one. I know you. I'd rather be slow than slower, but you know. Any, any highlight today has to start with our 40-year-old brethren, North Carolina brethren. And that's Vince Carter because you said about playing a game, guys that lose their athleticism can still do things and understand the, the, the movement and the style of play. So when you have the ball, when Vince Carter gets it here, instead of the shot fake, the drive to the lane, and stop it right here because this is the most underrated thing in basketball to me. The ability to draw two, most guys think that that's it. That is a talent to draw two people. When you draw two, you find one. And Vince Carter, at 40 years old, still understands how to find one and, and jumps it over to a 35. But Mike Conley frees it here. This is a guy now who says, in these ISO opportunities, I will, with my $153 million, take these type of shots. And I think before this, he wasn't really taking these type of shots uh, Chuck, I don't think he had the confidence to just keep the ball this long in his hand and just play one-on-one -on -one basketball and take those shots. Last year, he was more of a pitch guy, get rid of it again. Once the pick and roll comes, and now he comes off the hair, freeze it. This is Mike Conley now pretty much with penetrate and pitch and get out the way. But this year, to me, he's much more aggressive, getting into the lane, and probably one of the best finishers. He finishes that time with his left, but one of the best finishers with his right hand in basketball. So to me, a lot more offensively aggressive for Mike Conley, which is good well, to see. Well, let me just say this. And if somebody gave me $150 million, my confidence would be through the roof. Through the roof <laughs> no question. Memphis uh, shooting 7 out of 12 from deep in the first half. They averaged 6 a game last year. They're going to surpass their total for threes made before the All-Star break 
this season. And they're up 59-48. Welcome to the American Express Halftime Report. American Express, the official credit card of the NBA. American Express Halftime Report continues. You got a message there, Kenny. Yes. Uh, LeBron and the Cavs taking on the Mavs. Oh, this will be down right In here. Dallas, it's the, uh, kind of the haves and the have-nots. But look what Dallas does tonight. You saw LeBron there, and you saw the, the hot start for Cleveland. Yeah. Wait, a 20, a 20, a no, start? they had a 22-5 to 5 run here. We're just showing you oh. bits and pieces of that 22-5 to give 5 it, run. Give it a, get a chance, Chuck. Get and, a chance. And, but Dallas coming off the win in San Antonio. Who's that man? Yeah, I got and they have Kirk. a lot of they have talent, Chuck. That's one thing Dallas does have. They just have injured talent. And Look at Ooh. Yogi Ferrell, man. Can Yogi! He, he started the year with Brooklyn, his second game with Dallas. Hit a couple of big free throws in the win over the Spurs. And then on um, this night, he's big again. 19 points, five rebounds, three assists. <laughs> he didn't take any chances with his mama. History of Shaq. That's funny. And my, and my. He said his mama loves it too. Yeah. He just said it, he said it before you yeah. could get it out. Thank you, brother. Wait, that's an LSU tie? Yeah. Yes. Thank you, brother. Love you too. Well, we stumped, we stumped nice LSU coffee. a couple weeks ago. <laughs> what did freaking football? do? <laughs> no, not in football. Y'all play what basketball at all, bro? Yeah. I didn't even know y'all play basketball. You're a funny guy. I'm just saying. 